My name is Dan Conklin. I am part of the animal rescue team here at SeaWorld. And today we've released a 320 pound loggerhead sea turtle. This particular sea turtle was so weak and emaciated, it was found floating. The cause of his problems could have been related to ingestion of trash. It's actually a very common problem with sea turtles. They often eat trash and become impacted. And so that's why it's so important to avoid throwing trash in the, in the ocean and clean up trash whenever you see it. SeaWorld is one of the few organizations in the world that has the expertise to handle big sea turtles like this and to rehabilitate them. Typically, most sea turtles will be in rehabilitation for several months before they're good enough to go back into the wild. It's very rewarding to be a part of the rehabilitation program at SeaWorld. A lot of these animals wouldn't make it without our help. A lot of them have been impacted by human influences, so it's nice to be able to give back a little bit and rehabilitate these animals. If people want to learn more about what SeaWorld does for rescue and rehabilitation of marine animals, they can actually go to SeaWorld.org and learn more about what we do.